car here. Let's format a text slicer in Power BI. Let's go ahead and add some data. So first thing I want to do is I want to grab my slicer visualization and I'm going to drop it here. And this one, let's just say product category. Let me minimize this one. I'm going to say product category. So I'm going to add product category here. We want some information. So I'm going to add in a table. And in my table, let's just add product sales. And let's get rid of, let's just change his name. And we'll bring this one over here. And not to make it too big, let's just go here. So how will we format this slicer? So the way we'll format this slicer is by going into format your visual. So if I go into format your visual, we have visuals, then we have general. And in visuals, we can just go ahead and start expanding the slicer settings. The first thing we see is the option to change the orientation of our slicer. So as a default, we're going to get a vertical. And if you change it, we'll change it to horizontal. And by changing it to horizontal, now you'll see that now we have horizontal visualization for our slicer. So instead of that vertical selection, now we have a horizontal slicer selection. So when we click into each one of the slicers and click on advertisers, we have this horizontal slicer. And then if you don't want to have to hit control every time you click on a different one, you can also keep this selected, go into your format visual. You want to go into selections and you want to turn off multi-selection with control. You just turn that off. With that off, now you can click on different selections in your slicer and you'll see that they're, they'll all be selected as you select them. And you can just simply click them to unselect. The next thing you want to do is expand the slicer header so you can toggle this on and off. So if you toggle this on, you can come down here where it says product category and you can change the font, the font size. You can make this bigger and you can also come here to change the border. So you can change your border color so it can be that color or we can change it to something like that where it's blue. Uh, font color will remain black. You can also change the font. So this is changing the font of our title text. So let's just minimize the text and just focus on a border. So we have border positions. So we have top, we have bottom, we have left, and we have right. So this is just giving us a border around our slicer header. And we can just turn that old torrent select those to get those to go away and well, let's just change this back to black we can increase this line width so we can make this thicker and if i pull this down now you can get to kind of now you can see the whole thing and you can turn that thickness down and let's just minimize that then we can change the background right now the color is transparent but we can change this background to another color so if we change this to orange so now that changes the slicer header background and we can just change it back to that or we can just get rid of the slicer header altogether and then we can go to values our font color is this black you come down here and change the border position so we can say we can get rid of the top bottom left and right so if we get rid of this all together let's just say we did that when we select this, all we have is just the selection itself without all the border details. And if we go to background, right now the background is blank, but we can change the background to something like that. Or if you want to see our letters, we can change it to orange. If you don't like it where it is, you can come here and you can pull it over to the side like this and you can change it to even though we selected horizontal in our slicer settings by minimizing it and pulling it to the corner we can get it in this vertical format or you can change it here to more horizontal format 
or you can expand it across like this to get a selection like this so it's looking more like some buttons and triggers and that is how you format a text slicer in Power BI.